Hi, I'm Captain Rick Renew with the Bloomfield Fire Department. We're here down in Ocala doing our final inspection on our Typhoon 100 foot uh, Metro Aerial. We come from uh, up north Jersey. We are a 78 man department with a uh, 10 man uh, volunteer uh, contingent that help us out and everything else. We're here getting this E1 is replacing a 96 E1 110 Metro. Um, we like the E1 for its uh, longevity, the aluminum uh, body, the construction of it with the extrusions, and the aluminum aerial also uh, with its, uh, its lack of maintenance, so to speak, um, versus a uh, steel aerial. Uh, another selling point on this uh, piece of equipment is the fact that E1 has never had a aerial failure in its entire history of making uh, aerials. Some of the neat things that we did um, different on this truck, uh, our tools were kind of in a uh, in a compartment just laying in there. So we uh, built this um, large tool board, um, something that we did on our, our last, our previous engine that we have, Emax pumper that we got from here. Um, we mounted our hinges down low, back up where we're coming from. We're gonna replace these pins with um, loops and we'll be able to swing this door all the way open and we'll be able to access the tools on the other side. In this compartment here, we have 1,000 pound rollout trays, 500 pound uh, tilt down uh, rollouts. And again, we'll be able to pull the pins on these doors, open them up all the way to get possibly the, the fans and everything uh, up off the sides of the tray much easier. Down here, we just have a pretty long storage compartment. In the two rear compartments we went with the roll-ups, in here, we're gonna have our extrication equipment on this side. On the other side, um, we're gonna have all our saws. So if we're in a tight street, we don't have to worry about the doors opening up and the guys can come over and just roll them up and, and get their stuff out. On the back side here, um, we went with the ladders off the back. This is a style that we had on our last truck. Um, E1 has redesigned the ladder tunnel for us. So we're able to get a 35, two 28s, 20 straight, and two 16 straights. Um, our dealer, Absolute, up in uh, South Plainfield, Jersey, um, they will, if we want in the future, be able to readjust this tunnel here for where we can uh, put on another 35 footer if we want. So we'll be able to carry two 35 footers um, up on, uh, on the truck. The other reason that we chose this apparatus is for the jack spread. With these scissor jacks that they have, they're, um, they're nice and compact. Um, if you come over here, you can see, um, here we are, we're parked against the fence. We know if we're gonna be able to open up a cab door, we're gonna be able to set the jacks. So our streets are pretty tight in certain areas. So this is a huge thing for us. And I hope we got, you know, many, many years uh, out of this truck as we did the last one.